Hi! It's 2018, guys. <laughs> Let's make it a good one. Today, I'm going to be cleaning up my face and reviewing a few of the products that I started using this year. Okay? Let go. As far as the first step of removing my makeup, nothing has changed since 2017. I still either use coconut oil like I am in this video or micellar water. I allow it to sit on my face for a minute, melt that makeup away, and since today I'm out of my cotton pads, it's gonna be paper towels, okay? <laughs> a whole bunch of them. <laughs> Most people with oily skin, I've noticed, tend to shy away from using coconut oil in this way because it is comedogenic. That means that it does clog pores, but it's no problem for me. I'm good. I love it. So after this, I have started using this new oil cleanser. I had never used an oil as a cleanser. I, I had never thought of it. I know I've been using coconut oil to remove the makeup, but I've never thought of using an oil as an actual cleanser. So I picked this up in Walgreens, and I kind of like it. It smells like kind of like rose water. Do you use rose water? I like it. I like the scent. It's not overbearing. Now what I did here is add some water. You're supposed to add a little bit of warm water to work up a bit of a lather there. I do then go in with my Vanity Planet brush. I am about to order some more brush heads. I have a review on this brush. If you want to check it out, go ahead and check it out. I do like it. I mostly, mostly use it on days that I do wear makeup. On days that I do not wear makeup, I would use the silicone head if I feel like I need it. But otherwise, I just use my hands, you know. I like to keep things simple. But if I need some equipment, sometimes you just got to get in there, yeah? To tell you the truth, the whole reason for this video is this product right here. Everything about it just screams fancy and just luscious and hydrating and just fun. I love, even that's the color just makes me feel so good. It is infused with charcoal. I guess that's where the blackness is coming from. It's easy to apply. It's so smooth. The cooling effect on my skin feels great. It is soft. I really do like it. And it really doesn't have much of a scent to me, which is awesome because if I'm keeping something on my face for a little bit, I don't want to smell weird things. <laughs> so I do like it. Now what I will say about this, um, I really didn't like the applicator because I, I was scooping way too much and I ended up putting way too much on my face, which is why it took me a little more than 10 minutes to dry my face. So if I was to use it again, I mean when I do use it again, I'm going to be using a brush or my fingers to apply this. Okay, now that it's dry, I'm going to wash it off. Now washing it off, listen, I saw some people using... Um, a wet cloth a damp cloth and I think I'm gonna do that next time because it took forever to, to wash it off and it was a little messy it really was a little messy but I like it and also it's a moisturizing mask which is something I definitely need because I do have very oh there she goes with the serum the other thing anyways I was saying I do have really really dry skin so I love moisturizing products and the fact that that mask wasn't like making my face shrivel I liked it now let's talk about the serum all right this is something that we use on our faces to make sure that they tighten up it helps with the collagen elasticity and all of that stuff here I was I was yeah it feels really good it feels really good and then I went on and acted crazy like those girls on Instagram in my head I was looking like them but obviously mm, yeah mm, no you're not supposed to use this much okay <laughs> they say two to three drops but you know I do the most I do the most so it feels good applying it it's smooth it goes on smooth when it's in the process of drying it is a little tacky it kind of feels like sticky but then when it's dry it doesn't feel that way my skin felt tighter it felt supple but tighter like I was awake like you know what I mean you know what I mean you know what I mean girl you know what I mean <laughs> If that ain't healthy skin, shut your mouth. Look at that. Well, forget the raccoon eyes. Guys, I don't sleep, so I'm kind of always dark in that area with my eyes, you know, under my eyes. But hey, get it, girl. Get it, get it. 
I really like it by the way I do like it now because I have super dry skin I definitely have to go over it with my ride or die this was Bay 2017 my L'Oreal Hydrogenius for normal to dry skin it feels good and putting it on top of this serum mm, the application felt good I just love face products I love it when my skin feels alive when my cells feel rejuvenated and that's how this routine makes me feel And here is the close-up. That's my skin, live in action, no filter, no nothing, okay? I'm working on clear skin, beautiful skin for 2018. What you doing? Honey, if you have more time, check out my previous videos. Connect with me on social media. You're awesome for watching. Bye.